Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. My name is Ankush. In this lecture, we are going to discuss about the deploy mode. So, we know like whenever you are submitting your Spark application by using Spark submit. So, along with the Spark submit, we also need to specify deploy mode. So, there are two type of deploy modes are available one we called it as a cluster mode and another thing we called it as a client mode so let's try to understand the background story of it whenever you are running your spark application so let's say you are sitting here and you have submitted the spark application once you submit your spark application what will happen this Spark application you are submitting from the client machine. Let's assume that this is your client machine from where you are submitting your Spark application. Now there is a person we called it as a yarn. This yarn is the resource manager which will say that in order to run this Spark application, yarn will provide the resources. Okay, so he is your resource manager. Okay, so we got the resources from here. What it will do? It will create a two container so one container he will create it on your worker node where this container where our driver is running and we called it as a am container or some people are also calling it as a application master container which will store your main program so your execution of your spark application actually start from here which is from your worker node and one of the worker node your application master container will start where our driver program will be stored but this driver program is stored on your worker node which is the part of your cluster so you can have multiple workers so let's say this is my worker number one worker number two we can have multiple worker depending upon your spark your configuration of your project so basically what will happen your driver program is running from your cluster because this is a complete cluster only what is cluster cluster this is your cluster this is the part of your cluster and all these machines are connected to each other and your driver program which is basically your main program is running from the cluster and this mode we called it as a cluster mode and what about the client mode in client mode what will happen this driver program which is your main program will start from the client machine only here only so your application master container that container will be created over here your driver program will be running from here so whenever you have opportunity to tell like what is the difference between client mode and cluster mode there is only one difference between client mode and cluster mode is in cluster mode your driver program will be running from the worker node which is the part of your Hadoop cluster itself and in client mode your driver program will run from the client machine from where you are starting the execution of your spark all right now there is a next question like which one we should prefer we should prefer client mode or cluster mode so let's assume that you are using any interactive shell like you know PySpark okay on your command prompt you open the PySpark shell that time you can use your client mode okay let's say another example is your notebook Jupyter notebook many people are using the Jupyter notebook for the testing purpose that time you can use the client mode but let's say you want to run your spark application on the production environment most of the time we are using deploy mode equals to cluster cluster mode is really really important because let's say you submitted submitted your spark application and your account get logged off still your spark application will be running on the cluster many times you know in production environment when we do the development and you want to test something we submit our job and we wait for the dinner lunch 
and after some time when I want to see the log details whether it is successful or failed I can check it there is no problem even my account get logged up but in client mode it will not like that okay so depending upon your usage like let's say you want to do some development just testing okay testing means just like you are doing some practice use the plus use the client mode or whenever you are using it in your production environment use the cluster mode okay so this is the difference between your client mode and cluster mode i hope it is pretty much clear and if you are looking for spark training or hadoop training you can reach out to me and i'm going to start my new hadoop spark training from the next week thank you so much bye bye